games that I would like to see remastered on the PlayStation 4 and Xbox One. For those who are asking, what is this? This is going to be a video where I'm going to be showing what games I like to see from the from the past consoles to see on the PlayStation 4 and the Xbox One. This does not feature any gameplay or any of that stuff, so I'm going to be picking up games, going to be telling you guys which games I would like to see. Starting with this one, Red Dead Redemption. Now, even though I like to see a Red Dead Redemption 2, a whole new game with a whole new graphics and gameplay, but I wouldn't mind seeing a remastered version of this game since Red Dead Revolver was put on the uh, PlayStation 3. But I think we mostly might see Red Dead Revolver since P PlayStation 4 is doing backwards compatibility. I think that's how you say it. On PS2 games instead of PS3. But even though it would be nice to see this game remastered, like with some graphic changes and like some, like, it would be really nice to see this go from being played on this controller to this controller. So yeah, like, if they were to remaster this with, with all its DLC, even the Undead Nightmare campaign, I think people would buy this game in a heartbeat. Like, people would be pre-ordering this game like hell. Like, this game is probably something a lot of people want to see on the PlayStation 4. But I think Xbox One is getting this game since they're doing backwards compatibility with Xbox 360 games instead of Xbox original games. So yeah, I think Xbox... One is game this game. I'm not sure, but if they were to return master this game, like and put it on the PlayStation 4, like holy hell, I think a lot of people would buy this game in a heartbeat. Like I said, all right, moving on. Now this is a game I'm sure a lot of people have asked for remastered. Skyrim. Like what a great story! How the dragons have returned then. And you and Ty with their faith, like, you're the chosen one and all that. Like, this game was epic. Like, it was a good open world adventure game. Like, I would like to see this game on the PlayStation 4. Like, it would be perfect. Because the last Outer Scrolls game we got was so shit. Like, Outer Scrolls Online, holy hell. But the problem with that game is people expect it to be great exactly like Skyrim. Like, but in the developers even warned us before buying this game. I mean, Outer Scrolls, but if they were really to remaster the Legendary Edition with all the DLC, Dawn Guard, Heartfire, Dragonborn, I think people would also buy this game as well, like a Legendary Edition, and maybe, I think if they updated the graphics a little bit or more, I think this game would be so great, like, I even think this game, if this game was updated, I think this game would also be running at 60 frames, like, but... Depends how big they would update the graphics. Plus, if this game was remastered, I would delete Fallout 4 in a heartbeat. So yeah, I really want to see Skyrim on the PlayStation 4 as well. Alright, moving on. Now this one I would like to see. Like, great zombies. Not so much of a campaign, but it's great. And plus, set in Vietnam. I think that's the same as set in, but... This game would make a perfect game remaster. Like, if they were to reach a master, it with all the zombie maps and, like, all the other multiplayer maps, I think this game would be good. Like, everyone would probably buy this game and go back to this Call of Duty and instead of playing the shit ones we got, like Advanced Warfare and Black Ops 3, like, this game would be perfect on it. I would also like to see Black Ops 2 on the PlayStation 4, like, this game would be awesome to see, like, it had great multiplayer, the zombies were also great, not much of a campaign, even though I didn't play through half of it, but this would actually make a great thing, I think people would go back to this game instead of Black Ops 3, like, I think more people would play this game over Black Ops 3, since it's not futuristic as Black Ops Sure he is, and plus, there's no boost jumping or thrust jumping or any of that shit. So yeah, if they were to master this game, have good graphics up a little bit, and all the zombie maps, and every map that was ever added, I think this would make a perfect good game. Like, I like to see this. And other games I like to see remastered, even though I don't have them. I like to see Modern Warfare 1. Or should I say COD 4 Modern Warfare? I would also like to see Modern Warfare 2 remastered. 
since I never got the chance to play them. I also like to see World at War remastered, but I highly doubt that's going to happen though. I highly doubt they're going to remaster the old Call of Duties. And maybe Modern Warfare 3. Like, I'm not so sure about that one. Because people say it sucks. It's an MW2 clone, but I'm not sure. Alright, next one. I'd like to see Grand Spell 4 remastered. If they were ready to ma master this one and make some, like, changes, like, add the weapon wheel for players who are used to the weapon wheel one. But some people would not like that because you... You, the thing is, you gotta keep the games at their classic base, but if they were to remaster this one and have Lost and Damned remastered and a complete edition with also Gay Tony, I think it would make a perfect game and also to boost the amount of players you can have in a session. Plus, people would be probably happy to go back to this game as well because the cops weren't so crazy and plus you can turn the cops off in multiplayer though. Plus, you didn't have to worry about money and all that stuff like GTA Online. But overall, I think Grand Theft Auto 4 would make a good remaster because they remastered like two times the uh, San Andreas by City and GTA 3. Like, it's on Xbox 360, PlayStation 3, and they've both been put on PS4 with 1080p and 60 frames. So, yeah, this game would not be a bad remastered. Like, with all the DLC and stuff. So, yeah, I wouldn't mind seeing this game on the PlayStation 4. Alright, last but not least is... Lego Star Wars The Complete Saga. Now, I had a good blast with this game. Like, I played the separate version on the GameCube with my brother. When it was only just me and my brother, like, before my second brother was born. So, yeah. This thing bring, brings back so many memories, like... But I highly doubt this is going to happen, maybe, but I don't know since the uh, Lego Star Wars The Force Awakens is coming out. So it's probably going to be a remastered version of the talking, but with talking this time, maybe. So yeah, maybe they're, I don't know, like, I highly doubt Lego Star Wars 4, yes, I'm calling it Lego Star Wars 4, the one that's coming out will be, what's the word, I lost it will be uh, just The Force Awakens, but who knows. I think they're gonna re put all the complete saga with this new Lego game that's coming out, like... I think Lego Star Wars The Force Awakens will include all of this. And maybe if they were to remaster this version and make it where there's split screen and the battle arcade, but... Like I said, for ge some games, you gotta keep the classics the way they are. So yeah. Alright guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Subscribe and like, leave a comment, and one thing, what games would you guys like to see from the PlayStation 3 or Xbox 360 remastered for both the PlayStation 4 and Xbox One? Alright, leave a comment, and I'm out of here.